Hi everyone, today I wanted to swatch an Essence palette that's called I Like to Mob It Mob It, which is a pun on the I Like to Move It Move It. They have a whole line of these six pan palettes. They have a green one, a blue one, a taupe one, I believe, and they all have kind of funny punny names. It's obviously I'm a purple girl um, and I'm a color collector, so I recently learned that mauves look pretty good on me. So I wanted to try this one. Um, I expected to want kind of this whole set, but I had a lot of the colors in other palettes. Um, it does have a mirror in here and um, these gorgeous, you know, six mauvey tones. These do have names. I'm going to put them up on the screen while I'm swatching rather than try to read them out so I don't have to flip the palette over. Uh, forgive my nails. This is just the kind of person that I am. Um, here also you can see it's cruelty free, vegan. Uh, I don't know what the other symbols mean. But the ingredients here also in case you're interested in that kind of thing. Uh, so here we go with the swatch. All right, starting with the top left and going left to right, we've got a very pale lavendery purple. Next is a very deep metallic plum. Interesting choice next to that one, but hey, they only have six. After that, we have this kind of medium pink color. Actually, now that I'm looking at it on here, it does pull a little purple as well, which makes sense because this is a purple mauve palette. And then the bottom row, we have a metallic lavendery color. We have a grayish purple mauve. I actually love this color. It's very unique. And then the last one, the last one is kind of a warm mauve purple, mauve, mauve. It's like a British pronunciation and an American one. I'm from America though. So it's a little more warm. It's another metallic. So we've got three mattes, three metallics, all on the purple mauve spectrum. Um, you can create some really nice looks with this. However, I will say it's a bit sheer. It's not completely like well pigmented. Um, so I was a little disappointed in that. But if you're going for a subtle look, I definitely recommend these. Plus I think they're only $3. And they really do very well for that price point. So I hadn't tried any eyeshadow from Essence. Um, I do like this, but I, I wish it were a tiny bit more pigmented on the eyes. I'll be experimenting with this as we go now that I've swatched it. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you soon. <laughs> see if I can darken that up a little bit. No, oh, no. No, please stay in frame. This is so hard to, to film.